It's good people. Eskimo Cold, Eskimo Cold Beats .com. A little video just to uh, put some stuff out there, maybe inspire some people, give them some new ideas, or to give up because their hat's not in it and they're not doing the right things or at least learning how to, then there's just a virus in the game. So, um, rappers, rappers don't make money in 2014. And you're probably thinking, oh, but so-and-so's making money and so-and-so's making money. Well, that's because they're not rappers. Business. Business. Just being a rapper is getting you nowhere. The only reason the rappers nowadays are making money is because they're not rappers. They're businessmen. Like, uh, when they wear a certain clothing all the time, or they drink a certain drink all the time, it's not always because they just like the brand. And that's what it is, it's the brand. And that brand is, they might not disclose it, but they've, they've given them some sort of deal, you know, money. Diversifying the income stream. You know, if you think that you're gonna make money off just making music and selling mixtapes, nah, not in 2014. It was that simple back in the day, but now it's all marketing and branding. You know, investing in yourself for everything from down the beats to adverts, you know, promotions, do shows. A lot of you say you're rappers, but you ain't even doing shows. No wonder you're not getting money, because as a rapper, if you want to do it as a rapper and don't want to get into business so much, then you at least need to be doing shows. You know, how, how can you expect to have this buzz on Facebook, online, if you haven't even got a buzz in your hometown, if, you, if your hometown don't even know you rap, if you can't walk through the city centre or whatever and people ain't like, oh shit, it's so-and-so. Not like, I'm not expecting some celebrity treatment or whatever, but at least be, people know, even if they don't say, oh, there's so-and-so, I've heard of him. I've been to his shows, blah, blah, blah. But you, you can't say that you're doing that. Because to see you just constantly post the same shit in every Facebook group, on Twitter, the same shit all the time, that shows me there's no growth. There ain't no growth. You need to be expanding. Like, obviously, if you're just doing the same thing all the time and not getting... It, like, you, you'll increase your views from, say, say you've got 500 views on a video or a track. Just because you get to 3,000, 4,000, that is not an achievement. Why? Because you've done nothing on top of that. You're still, you're just getting the same views. Just because the maximum amount of views isn't going up doesn't mean that, like, maybe it starts off with five views. Every, say, every day you get five views. You know, if, if tomorrow you're not getting 10 views in place of five, then you're not showing growth, you're not doing what you need to be doing, and you think, it's just slack, I'm sick of seeing slack, people, people saying I'm the hottest, I'm the hottest on Facebook, I'm the hottest, everyone says they're the hottest in Chirac, I see that on every single video, and none of them are, none of them are, the hottest in Chirac are people like, obviously Chief Keef, he's, he's made his mark, he's left his name, and that's what kind of, Blew it up a little bit recently. Obviously, you've had people from back in the day doing it. But like recently, Chief Keef is the biggest name. But then you've got people like uh, his little Dirk, you know, those kind of squads. They're, they're out there doing the shows. They're mingling with the rappers that have got the right ideas, that are making the moves. You know, you can't just sit in your bedroom posting your links, posting your links, calling yourself the hottest rapper in the fucking game. You fuck. The hottest rapper in your fucking bedroom, bruv. That's it. In your bedroom, you're the hottest rapper. And I don't want this video to be a thing where people think, oh, you know, he's just cussing rappers out. You know, no, no, I'm cussing lazy ass motherfucking people out, no matter what you do, because that counts for producers, that counts for everyone. Do what you always did, get what you always got, and if you don't change it, you ain't going nowhere. Work on your business, invest in your Facebook ads, invest in your Google ads. In fact, do you know what I mean? Some of these have even got jobs, and what you do, you go and buy the, when you get paid, you don't think, right, let's expand this fan base, let's go put some ads in there, let's, let's put a payment on a show, and let's get a, a deposit down and get a show booked, pick up some fans, and make at least some of the money back, because you've got to sacrifice, you're going to lose a bit of money to gain a bit of money, and that's, that's just the way the world works, no, they just want to go out and they want to buy their new Jordans, you know, they want to go out, get drunk, and pull some basic bitches, it just pisses me off. Not pisses me off, you know, I, I get on with my day and it doesn't affect me. I still do what I do, always looking to expand. But it just... 
I just see so it does my it does my head in that I see so much talent because some of these Facebook rappers I see them and I think yo they're levels with what's out there talent wise but they don't deserve it they don't because they're not putting the effort they're not putting the money in you've got to build a brand a business you need to be making moves outside of music to make moves inside music and that is something that you need to understand shit ain't gonna hand hand itself on a plate just you posting you just keep posting 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 the same shit over and over again until one day isn't it even if so, someone big you could have the, the biggest the biggest the most important person on the biggest label hear your stuff and you could be the best rapper you could be better than everyone out that doesn't mean they're gonna come and sign you because they they might have accidentally come across your video but they ain't hearing your name in the streets. They ain't hearing, what, where's their money? Why are they going to invest their money in you? If you can't invest your own money in yourself, if you can't think off your own, just off your own merit, you know what I mean? It's just, people need to elevate. As a rapper, if you want to be successful, you need to switch up everything you're doing now if it's not working for you. Do not be afraid of change. Change is the only way forward, the only way. And don't let anybody tell you anything different if you, like i said you do the same thing you've always done you get the same thing you always get now i hope people take a positive rather than negative from this video because all i want to see is growth from people getting where they deserve to be because if you don't deserve it no one shows any sympathy for you if you don't make it so yeah eskimo cold eskimo cold beats just got a new deal five leases for 30 dollars means more people can have more beats for a more affordable price you know, I'm cutting my prices down to help people out because I was still making sales even when I was selling them 20, 24 a piece. Now I'm doing it five for thirty dollars. Just try and get help people get some more music out there. So yeah, hit me up if you want any advice. Get at me too. You know what it is: Cardiff City, Wales, UK, Beat Selling Squad, all of that. Peace.